Hey everybody, Kalma here with a new video in the same setup, same place, and same makeup that I used in a different video. Oh, I am on a roll here. But today I have a very exciting uh, unboxing and try on video. I recently made a purchase at oh, Dolls Kill once again. They were having a clearance sale and I had been selling a lot of things in my wardrobe. So I had some money saved up to get some new stuff that I would actually wear. So I got this big box and I'm really hoping the rest of my order is inside of the shoe box that this obviously is because I ordered some shoes and like three other things and I'll be very sad if those three other things are not in here because I actually got this about two weeks ago now, three weeks ago. I just haven't had the time to make a video and I don't like opening things that I intend to make a video of beforehand because I like to have video evidence in case something is wrong or whatever. Nothing like that has happened yet, so thankfully that... I mean, I could probably have opened this, but I like doing these on video for you because I personally really enjoy watching unboxing videos and I thought you guys might do. Let's go ahead and open up this package and see what I got. Ta-da! Big surprise, I got more... Hey everybody, sorry about that. My camera ran out of uh, space on the SD card, so I had to delete some stuff. But I got more current mood, current mood shoes, because these were super, super cheap again. And it looks like they might have put everything else in the box, because it's a little exploding right now, but we will see, I guess. Thankfully, everything is actually in the box. So that's awesome. Uh, the first thing I got, which I think is pretty damn cool and pretty damn useful as someone who is very, both very lazy and likes to accessorize with, accessorize with fishnet stuff are, or is, this full bodysuit. So it's this fishnet full bodysuit, which thank God has the crotch cut out because the only reason I don't own more bodysuits is because most of them don't have a holeless crotch. Most of them have like a little weird button or like velcro that you have to open and that's just annoying personally. This just makes things a lot easier. This just goes on under everything and then I can just put my underwear over it and it'll be a lot easier to use the restroom. Anyway, I got this really cool bodysuit. I think it's really cute. Hopefully it fits. I'm kind of tall for America's standard size. So hopefully this isn't like an awkward, awkward, uncomfortable fit. I guess we'll see. The next thing I got is in a little baggy, but if you go on their website, you'll see this cool pentacle like body chain thing with a black um, like onyx looking kind of stone on it. Um, so it's, this is it. Um, I meant to buy all this stuff earlier and get it in a medium, but it was all sold out, so I had to get a small, so I don't know if it'll fit. Uh, I guess you'll see if it does, because if it does fit, there'll be a clip over all this audio that I'm doing right now. Um, if you don't see a clip over all this, then it probably didn't fit and I might be selling it. So if I am selling it, I'll put a link down below in case I am. But anyway, hopefully it fits, it's pretty damn cool. Oh. This was about $10, I believe, and the bodysuit was about, they don't have the price on here. I think it was 18 before tax. Yeah, not bad. This next thing is a sweater. It's pretty cool. It's like a tactical vest, but in sweater form, which is pretty damn awesome because most of the things I own don't have pockets and I'm wearing pants today, but that's because the one job I have, I have to wear pants. I wasn't wearing this top to work though, I was wearing something else. But I got this cool sweater, tactical sweater, for I think around 15 with tax, like after tax and everything, and that's pretty damn cool. It's just a plain black sweater, and it has all these pockets on the front, which is pretty fucking cool. Sorry for the swearing. I'm just, I still haven't decided if I don't want to swear or if I want to swear on this channel. I think I'm just going to, just because. But it's a nice sweater. Um, it's not like fuzzy on the inside or anything, so it's probably not going to be super warm. But I think it's pretty cute. It smells like a new sweater. And I just, I just enjoy pockets and having pockets. Like, look at this. It's not as big as I was hoping, but hey, that'll probably fit my phone or something. It's about the size of my phone. 
then there's three little like chesticle pockets and then one smaller one no idea what I'll put in those and then there's this other one right here not much but you know just having pockets in general is just such a nice thing and this will somehow make my life easier I am absolutely positive positive. and the last thing which I am terribly excited about because these were about the same price as my Madonna platforms that I got from Dolls Kill recently which were around $30 these boots were actually around $30 as well they're they kind of look like old Victorian shoes mixed with gothic pikes mixed with rhinestones on the heel but this is what it looks like just out of package it's a nice velvety material I believe I got this in a size 10 because my feet are rather large um, but it's really really cute old Victorian style shoe with rhinestones on the heel which I think is a cool touch I got these because I just personally actually really love this style of shoe and I haven't owned a pair yet because they're usually kind of expensive but this also just could go with almost any look I can probably make it work with Lolita I can make it work with my everyday wardrobe they're just really freaking cool and they also came with some extra heels which is a problem that I have with shoes my heels always wear down really fast and always fall off so it's nice to have a replacement that's pretty darn cool so that's it for this I would call it a haul but it's not I don't what is the cutoff for a haul? I usually say around like five items. This is only four, so technically in my book it's not a haul, but like is there an actual cutoff for hauls? Is there a distinct line between an unboxing video and calling it a haul? Thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and give it a like and subscribe. If not, oh well, I don't really care. I care a little bit, just a little bit. I post once a week typically. I recently picked up a second job so I've been a little slow about that lately but I'm trying my best to get back into the groove, get back get back to things. So we'll see how that goes. Um, Yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye!